up guys, welcome back to Ron's Rides, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video where I have some information on when you'll be able to pick up an Alfa Romeo Giulia off of the lot for 2020. Now we've been talking about the 2020s for months. We got our confirmation on what everything is gonna be like, what it's gonna change, what's gonna be new, what's gonna be the same, and all of its glory. We've seen the spy shots, we've seen the official shots, we've seen everything. Now, we're wondering when can we get our hands on one of these? When are these gonna arrive to the dealership so you can go and pick out your favorite Alfa Romeo, and when can you take one home? Oh, so, it's gonna be a little while. Actually, probably at least another month or so. Now, as of releasing this video on December 13th of 2019, we're probably going to see the Alfa Romeo Giulia and Stelvio show up at the end of January 2020. Reason being, the factory layoffs. The Lazio plant, which is responsible for the Giulia and Stelvio's production, will be at a standstill for 25 consecutive days. Now, that stop is larger than last year's recording between 2018 and 2019, when the Giulia and Stelvio's production was interrupted for about three weeks, while the Giulietta remained for a stop for about four weeks. Now, keep this in mind that the month of January, even after reopening, follow the Christmas stop, will be characterized by further production stops. So for the moment, FCA has already confirmed a production stop for January 17th, but it's possible that the second part of the month, there will be further production stops with recourse to the layoffs for workers of the plant. So we can already see that from January 1st to January 20th, the production of the Alfa Romeo models and casino will be only active for about three days. Now the long stops of the production works in the casino plant will be followed by the debut of the 2020 Alfa Romeo Giulia and Stelvio. Now the new versions of the Giulia and Stelvio represent an important element for the future of Alfa Romeo. Now despite being a second rate update, it's also a real update received by the two Alfa models since the commercial launch. So Alfa Romeo really has to capitalize on these innovations to hold everyone over into the full refresh and into the release of the Tenale. So they need to guarantee substantial growth and deliveries ready for the next months of the year. So with that said, in the recent stops of the plants with layoffs, the Giulia and Stelvio will probably not hit the showrooms until the month of January, maybe even early February. Now I knew that you couldn't order them here in the US and I knew that the dealerships weren't allowed to put in their order until January. So when people were asking me when we'd see them, I'd you know, kind of play coy because of the fact that it wasn't official news yet. Now we know about the official layoffs and how long some of the layoffs will last. So now it's no secret, you're not gonna get the Giulia Stelvio for at least another month and a half. So with that said, 2020 will be very stingy for Alfa Romeo. After the launch of the Julian and Stelvio for 2020, we're not seeing anything really until the 2021 Alfa Romeo Tonale comes out. Now that CSUV will debut officially during the months of next year. Only in 2022 will the fourth model arrive, and that is going to be the BSUV. Now, both the Tenali and the BSUV will not be produced in Casino, so they will not be side-by-side -side with the Giulia and Stelvio. And for the Lazio plant, the future is linked with the Maserati DSUV that is also arriving in 2021 based on the Alfa Romeo Stelvio. So how are you guys feeling about not being able to get an Alfa Romeo Giulia or Stelvio right away? I know Alfa Romeo has shown us a lot we see all the new technology, all the new changes, and everybody just wants to get their hands on them. And the hype is up, the hype is real right now. I'm sure they have a lot of customers waiting in line. Maybe people trying to get beginning of the year deals, end of the year deals, or maybe people that their lease is over or they're ready to get into the next car. You know, Alfa Romeo is taking their time a little bit and I know people are a little frustrated because they're ready, you know, it's been a long time, they need something new from the brand and they got it, but they can't get it. So that's the frustrating part. Um, because I know a lot of people are saying that it's too little too late. Um, you know, Alfa Romeo's future, really, it's, it's, it's weighing on the Giulia and Stelvio and the Tonale. And the Tonale we won't see for another year on the production line. So with that said, I mean, to help Alfa Romeo out, they need everybody to get into these cars. The more time that it takes for these Alfa Romeos to get here and get on the lot so people can see them, you know, the more time they're gonna lose business and other people are going to go to, you know, possibly the German rivals or maybe even American cars or anything like that. They have a lot of other options out there and really you have to be quick on the draw in order to get the consumer's attention and really do good well in the market. But with that said, let me know what you guys think about not being able to buy the Alfa Romeo Giulia and Stelvio until almost the second month of 2020, where most car manufacturers have had their 2020 models out since June and on. Now with that said, if you guys enjoyed the video today, 
make sure you give it a thumbs up. Giving it a thumbs up helps get it up in rankings. More people can see it, and we can have a bigger discussion on when you can possibly get your hands on the 2020 Alfa Romeo Julias and Stelvios. And with that said, if you guys want to help support the channel, check the link down below. One of the links I do have is a PayPal donation in case you guys want to donate a dollar or two to the channel. It's always appreciated. You can also be Patreon subscribers as well, or you can check out the Ron's Rides merch in case you guys want to get a t-shirt, hoodie to keep warm, coffee mugs, stickers, anything like that to support. Definitely appreciate it. You guys can also check out the social media links, Facebook, Snapchat, Instagram. I always post some great stuff on there that I cannot post on YouTube. So with that said, make sure you check that out or just subscribe to the channel. Click that notification bell so you get these videos straight to your inbox. Guys, we will talk to you in the next Ron's Rise video. Take care. Thank you for your time. We'll see you then. Peace.